I think the best gaps today are Twitter, and tear. And I think that I'm going to focus on the Twitter. This is just moving so much here. I didn't really figure out exact numbers for this yet. Let's just let's just focus on this, and and if for some reason it doesn't set up, then I'll then I'll go to one of the others. But I just think if I get distracted today looking at too many things, it's just we're not going to get it right. Um, I mean, there there is a lot. Of, I mean, there's a tons of good things. BMY, CYH, AZN. I mean, I didn't even rate some of these. Yeah, this looks good too. Here, I'll just put all these in the room as extras. So. You could probably do a lot of things today. That'd be funny. Yeah, you gotta get the entry right, but. That's always the case. Always. Oh, this is just going, look at this. Okay, so I'm focusing on Twitter. Um, I'll look at, you know, one of the other ones, Tear, or even BWLD, if this for some reason does not set up. Just want to focus on one thing today, though. Remind me when we're done, we'll look at the ACAM option. Okay, Twitter. It's gonna work. So I don't know where we're getting in. I don't have a stop yet, just, you know. But this is gonna work. Okay, let's see if we get a bounce in this. Okay, stop, and this is going to be 60, 24 by 60, 24 by 60 Twitter. And do not jump the gun, because we could get a better entry. right now get it right now be in it be in it be in it 60 get the stop in this is it this is it 
In fact, let's just figure out where it's going. Yep, this is gonna work. I knew I liked this today. All right, 17 is the first target though, but I don't think we get a bounce there, but we could. So where do I really think this goes today? Here, you could, you could, you could still do it. 1650, 1650, $16. Now I have it at 60 because the spread was 10 cents at one point this morning. It's not right now, but it was at one point. See now it's two, three. I have it at 60. And if we get a better entry, then I'll add more, retake it. Stop 1760 for me in the Twitter, even though it looks tighter in here. Oh, let's see if it holds. Crap. Tell you what, I'm going to give it 65. Move it quick to 65 if you're in it with me. Move it quick to 65. Let's see if it holds. If it doesn't, I'm going to stick, still stay on top of this. I just quick gave it 65. Expected bounce right there at the 200, but it could have just slapped right through it. Here, if you're not in it, I'm going to give you another entry. And I've got the stop at 65 now. If you're not in it, I'm going to give you another entry. In fact, you could add here. I'm not going to do that, but you could. Here, do it if you didn't do it. Just take it if you didn't get it. Where I'm already in it. It's going to work. You could do 29 by 65. 29 by 65, you could just take it right here. It's going to go. It's going to go. It's going to go. It's going to go. Twitter. All right. Let me just quick look at the other ones. Doop, boo, doop, boo, doop. All right. This actually did something here as well. Massive stop. Look at that. Woo. Um, let's look at this. This did not set up at all. Let's look at this. This is going now, but didn't call anything on that. This looks too thin. This is not doing anything at all. This flipped. Okay. Ha, doo -doo -doo -doo. I could have taken more. <laughs> I didn't do it though. Here. Twitter, Twitter, Twitter. Here. I knew this would work. Oh, my Lanta. And we'll talk about why later. And someone remind me to talk about ACAM because there was something else I wanted to say. In fact, let me write myself a sticky. ACAM, besides the option, there was another thing I wanted to say. Here, Twitter. I'm not even paying any attention to the market. It's almost like I don't even care. That's how much I like this. 1650. 17 could bounce. Mark Mobile, did you do it or not? Because of the volume in the morning, that was a made up rule that you made up, and I hope you didn't miss this. Did you do it or not? Target is 17, but we're here right now, and it's four minutes into the open, and it looks good. 1650, Twitter. Let's look at the market, which is red. <laughs> Mark Mobile did it. He's laughing. <laughs> Good, good for you. Here, let's look, let's look at this vibe. Oh my gosh, I forgot to talk about Facebook. Our friend, our ally. I forgot to talk about Facebook completely. <laughs> I forgot our poor old friend Facebook. Lewis, good morning. Uh, nothing here. Okay, you could get out of some at 17, but I'm gonna try to hold it. Here, let's see if we can get an under 17, Twitter. I wanna look at Facebook, I forgot about this thing. This ended up, I looked at this last night when it was like 168, look at it now. Wow, these things are just insanity. Wow. Okay, here we go, Twitter. Oh my Lanta. All right, focus, 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 focus. 1675. I hope everybody got it. We should have taken more. That would have been crazy. <laughs> but we should have. Here. Here, here, here. Do, 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 do. Our Mark Mobile's all out. Trade Alexi's all out. That's okay. That's perfectly fine. 1685, 86. Time of the day is 936. One more push down and I'll take it. How about that? Nice trade. And no drilling. 
Everything cooperated today. The sun is shining. No drilling. Good gap. Pick the right one. Fell right away. <laughs> All right, 85 was the low, I think. 85, 86. Did everybody get it? Smooth traders all out too, okay. I think this is one more push down the way because of the way that it dropped. But. Actually, the market's slightly red, but I, I just really don't know what the market's going to do today yet. Remember, Amazon's tonight. Don't forget. This did work. If you did this, you did it completely on your own. I didn't give you the call on this, the BWLD. And actually, I didn't even rate it. Uh, market is red at this moment. Um, did anyone do the, anything else, actually, besides Twitter? Did anyone do anything besides Twitter, which I called? Did anyone do anything on their own today? This has never looked right since, actually, since the earnings here, this Google. It's got to fix itself completely. Bob did BWLD and FFIV. Okay. Okay, this is rallying back, and I didn't get out of any. Let's just see here. FFIV, I did not look at it all. This looks tough. I, this... I don't even think I'd be in this. It's trying to break. It, this looks hard. Big fudge did STX to continue three days after? I think you could have done this yesterday. Did this gap today? I don't see anything here. I don't see anything to be doing in that. Okay, Twitter. Kind of aggressive to do it again, smooth trader. If you're if you really, really wanna, I'd give it a wide, wide stop. 1740. You could do it right here, put the stop at 1740. I think you'll be okay in case it pushes back or does a little taily thing. You could do it here, put the stop 1740. But I think it breaks again. Or a tight a tight one would be 99 by 30. Be tight. 30 cents or 40 cents. I'd rather see you do 40 cents. Just take it here. Twitter, I'm in. I'm waiting for it to follow through. I think this stays red today and just completely stays red today, actually. Um, and it broke. So did a good job keeping us in this trade. Um, could have taken more. Could have been really aggressive. Wasn't sure what the market would do today with Facebook up so much, which it really is up a lot. And looks like it's going to try to get to 200 before the end of 2017. It's going to be a race. Here, Twitter... I'm surprised some of you decided to do to, to not do this and do these other ones. Here, Twitter, pay attention now. This is it. One more push through the low, and I will be out, and it will be a wonderful, wonderful day. Here, Twitter. New York Bob did Twitter too. He's got nine hands apparently. <laughs> New York City Bob has 19 hands. <laughs> do this one, do this one, do that one. <laughs> Here. Okay, 91.90.
I didn't even look to see what econ's out this morning. Is there anything out? Does anyone know? Is there anything out at 9:45? Any econ reporting at 9:45 or 10 that could help this or hurt this? <laughs> that could work against us. Here. Here we go. Wow, here we go. I don't even know why I looked at anything else today because I really didn't like anything else. <laughs> I did just to appease you people. <laughs> 86, 87. Come on. You stinker. It did not break to the low yet. Crap. 85. All right, here we go. We got to break this area, though. We didn't do it yet. Now, what is the problem there? Whoa, did you see that? That looked like an invisible tick. Here we go, it should break the low. It didn't print, but did you see it? Did everybody see the invisible tick? That just happened here, Twitter through the low, it's gonna go. Wow, did you see it? It didn't print. Yep, there it was. It happened so fast, I didn't even get to see the number touch, but here we go, we're gonna break. Two invisible ticks in one week. Crap, no, it didn't do it yet. Eighty-six. Why is this number a problem? Hey, I'm hanging on to it, but I mean, it is it is flirting with that area. BMY, is it still going? Um, let's look at what the stop is here, though. Actually, it wasn't half bad. I don't know what the spread was here into the open, but this just dropped more than a buck. You ha it, was, it looks like it was very hard in there to do. You could have done that on your own. I actually did not rate it. Um, I had it on the list, and I'm still in this here now, and... I didn't get out of any. And I don't see a problem with that area, but it hasn't broken it yet. I'm still in the trade. BM1, BMY worked. Tough, tough entry there, though. But it had a dollar drop. I still like this to break through the low. Obviously, I'm still in it. Trying to decide down there a little bit ago if I was going to get out. But, you know, I think this is just push, pushing back if people are trying to buy it up and I think it's going to drop and break just like ACAM did yesterday the same thing target of 16 for Twitter It's gonna give another setup. So, I mean, you could do it again. I'd still put the stop at 40 though, if you do it again. You could do it again right here. If you if you did it, got out, you could do it again right here, put the stop at 40 again. Is that what you did, Smooth Trader? You could do it again. It is 9.45.
think it's waiting for this to smush on top of this. And the market here, again, really hard. I mean, look at the last two days of trading in the queues. Look at the last three days of trading in the SPY. Uh, Facebook is trying to hold. So I wanted one more push down. Maybe I should have gotten out at 85 or 86 when it did break the low, but I didn't do it. I did not do it. And I, here I am again trying to be patient, still in this trade. I wonder if I'm overly confident this week or something. Well, I guess I'm going to find out. Who's still in it with me? I didn't get out of it. I hope I don't get bitten in the butt with this. Trendy Women's still in it, okay. Dubai's is still in it. Love to trade gaps is still in it. So this is pushing back, but I don't think there's any way in the planet that this goes green today. And we have to stop well over the high. So I just wanna check one thing here. Big Fudge got back in. I just wanna check one thing, since now we have to wait. It's actually going to completely reset up again. I don't know what that noise was. It's actually going to completely reset up again. And when it does, I'll call it. Okay, while this is going, I'm gonna talk about something right in here because uh, I'm gonna quick do an option trade. I'm gonna send out for the letter, but I, just because there's nothing else I can do here and I'm staying with this Twitter. For those of you that have been having issues with emails, and this goes for everything, getting emails, getting the room, getting the option calls, all of the things. If you've unsubscribed to the main list, it takes you off of everything. So, that's just an FYI. In order to handle that, to switch it, you would have to not unsubscribe, email me, and then I would have to go in or have Rashawn actually go in, my assistant, and figure out um, what list to put you on, take you off of others. If you unsubscribe, you won't, you're not gonna get anything. So that is one issue that's come to my attention recently. That may be the result of some of you having issues with the emails. Actually, could have completely redone this twice. I wish I would have got out of now. I said that twice this week. Maybe I'm overly confident in these things, having some big days, but. All right, let's look at it. Well, it's rallied completely back here to where I took it, Chief, so I'm not getting out of any of it here. I wouldn't be getting out of any of it with profit here or like two cents or something. So here, let's just talk about the gap. Uh, Rumi wants to get back in. It's going to set up again in the five minute. That's what it's going to take. But I, I actually, I didn't react quick enough here. Looked good. Came down here. Didn't break again. Did, she probably should have gotten out of this here for the morning because now it is 9.51. And I really don't want to trade late today. I do think this has a bigger move in it, though. We have a stop so far away. But probably should have just reacted quickly here. But one of these bars here is when I did that invisible tick, and it looked so great. I thought it was going to fall. 
I thought I was gonna fall on break and now here I am. I'm in this trade, another trade that I'm in, waiting for a bigger move to go. This is the second time this has happened this week. I don't know, you know. I, I definitely am not doing another trade today though. I'm up for the week no matter what happens in this for me today. I not wasn't being a pig in this today, but you know, I, I like the gap. So let's just go over it. Uh, does anyone have any questions about anything else before I go over the Twitter? I'm still in it. So many of you to get out of it here and here. Some of you want to retake it. You got to wait now. If you did, if you did do it back in here, remember I told you to put the stop at 40. And I don't even know if that's going to hold. Really was kind of like a cheat entry. Does anyone have any questions about anything else before I go over Twitter? Is anyone in anything else? If you did BMY, was another watch. I didn't call the exact entry. That looked really hard setting the way it set up, but it did roll over. Not everything worked. We'll go over ACAM if we have time, which I hope that we do. The only way that I will have time to review ACAM, though, is if I'm out of this trade. Because <laughs> I don't want to look at anything else until I am. But I had an exercise I wanted to do today if we have time on ACAM. but I am still in this. Did it hold 40? No, it did. I will give a second call on it, Rumi, if it sets up again. Here's the market. Here's the market. Amazon earnings are tonight. This is at some insane number, which no one should be surprised. Let's look at this. Look at this, 1073, 1074, 1075, that's crazy. Okay, here you go, here you go, I'm gonna give you another call on this, it's gonna work, I told you. 10 by, 10 by 45, don't be tight with it. 10 by 45 is a five minute, if it hits, don't jump the gun, we're still in the original trade, if you're in the original trade with me, um, 10 by 45, I'm not lowering this stop. I will get out if it does not break the low the next time it does it, the 50th time. Um, 10 by 45, if you wanna do it another time, tear, just don't wanna lose that or miss that. Tear, what do you wanna go over here? Tear had a move and then it tore up. Tear tore down and tear tore up. I, tear didn't do anything here that looked easy either. I honestly think we did the easiest thing. I know BMY dropped a dollar, but what was the entry here? I mean, this was really hard. I mean, I, I'm not even sure. I'm not even sure if we would have done this. I mean, what was the entry here? This really didn't set up right. I mean, this there is no real entry in here. I got to be honest with you. You could have shorted this somewhere in here, put the stop somewhere in here, but what is what is the, actually, what is this entry? I don't see any real entry here. It broke and just fell. There's no real entry in here. So this really was very, very hard, and part of the problem with this was lack of volume. Lack of volume, and I guess that's why, I'd, in the end, I didn't end up rating it. In the end, I did not end up rating it because I knew that I wouldn't do it aggressively into the open, and it took about five minutes, it looks like, for the volume to come in, and then it just sold off, like on the fifth bar there. Twitter, if you want to do it a second time, 10 by 45. I'm not lowering the stop at this moment in time, no. But I am going to get out if it doesn't break that area in the low 90s, mid 80s, which... It's got to get back around yet. If you feel nervous, this is basically at the original entry. You could just kill it here, break even, wait till it hits in the five, take it at ten by forty-five. If you want to be, if you want to be tight, there's no real valid entry there. I've set up and BMY just broke. 
you wouldn't have had to just short it. And where would you have put in the stop? So that was hard. B, uh, the B, the BMW or LD or whatever the heck it is, the Buffalo Wild Wings, BWLD, has actually had a really big stop, but it did fall. Fell all the way down to 107. It's still going. I mean, this is actually did set up properly. Would have rated right. I like Twitter better, but it actually has a big number in sight for this too. I mean, this will hold today as well. So that, did anybody do that? I mean, that, that actually is resetting up again. I, I didn't call a trade in that today, but that, that looks good. And some of you did like that. This will need the five minute at the bare minimum or the 15. And if this goes over the number and then I'll have to give a different entry again, but it never hit 10. confident this week I'm trading so well If it, if it does another entry, I'll give it to you. The last one is off. It didn't hit. I don't want to go over anything else until I figure out what I'm doing with this, which I'm still in. Who's still in this with me? Let's take a poll. Journey Woman was? Who else? Love the trade gaps? Who else? Dubaz? Big Fudge? Smooth Traders? Flat? Shower Singers in it? Green Mavericks in it?
lot of you are asking questions. I just can't answer those questions right now. I'm still in this trade, and I, I was up money on it and didn't get out of it. It's just, you know, I just can't focus on anything else than what I'm doing right now with this. Love to trade gaps, you just killed it. Okay, love to trade gaps, killed it. I'm still in it. It hasn't retested the high of the day yet, but it, it is. It's going to. I mean, it, 58. Here's where I got the stop. No, if I get stopped out on this today, I'm just going to stop. I'll still be up for the week, and I don't know. I guess I missed my exit again today. I, you know, I don't think I did anything wrong with this. I think this would have continued. I think it looks like it was going to continue. I don't think I can shock this is green, but if I made a mistake, I made a mistake. I'll just live with it. Still up for the week. second. But let's double check the number. sense. I don't know if that's going to matter. This is the resistance. This is the level. This is the level that it, that it can't go over. Let's give it 68. You're still in it with me, which some of you are and some of you just killed it. 68 is the new stop for this. And that will be absolutely it. Gonna hold. Well, all right. Let's talk about it. It's gonna hold. It's gonna hold, and you can reshort it. But I just gave it a couple more pennies. Anyways, you can do a twenty-nine by sixty-eight. If that hits, and if there's another entry, I'll give it to you. Kind of tough here. Why? People people do like to buy these on support in this two hundred per moving average. But as you know, it's not a support that's gonna hold. It actually didn't already hold today. So was fine with that when I saw this lift here in the morning. We had, we were already in it. Gave it the room. Could have taken even more in here. Didn't do it. Anyways, let the let the drop happen. Didn't get out, even though it did go to the first target, which was 17, broke it. 
I thought 1650 was reasonable for this today. I did not think it was a piggy target. It's a dollar from tip to top for the stock on the day, and it was a good gap. And at that point, the market was not rallying. I wouldn't even say the market's necessarily rallying now, but it is making an attempt to hold. Anyways, this in here, I really thought would break. We watched it. We saw it. What the problem was here was this little guy here, which flipped. And, it, and actually, in the moment, I did see it. I actually saw it and thought about killing it at 17, and I would have made, you know, roughly 25 cents. And that would have been better than losing, true. I guess I could have taken half off at 17. I didn't react quick enough. This actually has been trading very fast today, which is fine, but didn't react quick enough. So didn't react quick enough here, here, or here when it didn't break and then flipped. So I'm, you know, I'm in it. Of course, at any point in time, I can decide to kill it. Some of you killed it up in here with a loss. That wasn't a good decision. You either stay with the trade or you kill it break even, which I told some of you could do in here. So if you don't like it and you're losing conviction, kill it break even, don't take the loss because then it could go on to work anyways, which it looks like it's going to try to do. And then you took a loss for nothing. So if you're, if you killed it up here in the 50s, it was, you kind of wasted it. You either stick with the trade or you kill it break even or you got out down there at the profit. So many people have been wanting to buy this stock thinking it was going to get bought or sold or whatever. And it's been doing all kinds of crazy stuff. But the overall trend of the stock has still been, you know, pretty much what I said all along. It's still been holding the downtrend here. And it has been sucking in a lot of people that have been buying it, but it never seems to go anywhere. I'm not surprised at all that it gapped down in the earnings. Look at this chart. Um, did think this was one of the top gaps today. Did set up very fast, very quickly. A lot easier than BMY. The best gap today, really, other than this, was BWLD, the Buffalo Wild Wings. But that I knew would be a big stop. And I also knew it would be spready. And um, I just like this. We could have done that if we didn't have this. So I was up in this. I'm down in this now. Not a lot, but I don't know what it does. But it can't get over this level here where we have the stop. It can't. And if it does, I'll be out with a loss on a day that I was up money, and I'll just live with it. You know, I'll just live with it because I am up for the week, and, and, and we have a day tomorrow, and I don't know. I just don't react quick enough. Good advice, Melissa. It was hard to watch. It slowly eat up, eat up the other. Yeah, yeah, it was. You could do it again. If you want to do it again, if you killed it up there in the 50s and didn't stay with it, you could do it again. 29 by 68, 30 by 68. I do believe this holds. It's This stock has so many different things going on in it. So many different people that are going long, going short, so many different things. Holy crap, it's going to hold. Here. Did anybody else kill it besides love to trade gaps? It is going to try to hold. Yep, 29 is going to be the 15 minute. Here are the five minutes triggering right now. You can do 40 by 68 on the five minute. It just triggered. Oh, my Lantia. So hard. Here, let's take a five minute coffee break. The trade's going to work. It was a rough one if you wanted to hold it. If you got out right away, so it was a quick, easy trade. If you got out in the first five minutes or 10 minutes, it was a quick, easy trade and you made money. And, and it is gonna work for those of us that are still in it. I, I, this is just how this stock is. You have so many people wanting to do different things. People are looking at this, some of them, that think of the long term, it's a good buy today and they wanna buy it in the down gap, thinking they're gonna get cheap. It, it, it's, it's not the right thing to do. The pressure's on the stock for the people controlling it, which is to the downside. That's why that's why it worked as a short right away. That's why it's going to work out for us, the ones that are also still in it. it you know, but there are people for some reason that think this is a good buy and they're not controlling the stock. And then also you have traders that like to buy this on support. So I do want to give a lecture today about ACAM. I do remember what it is and now I can relax. Gave it three more cents. Didn't even matter. Held 60, held 65. Give me a minute to get some coffee. I'll come back, we'll do the lecture, and I will be out of this uh, if it hits the low and doesn't break it. But I think now that it will break it, it's and it could happen between now and 10.30. Just give me a couple minutes here to get situated. Here, it's going to work. Yeah. Sorry, you killed the love of trade gap. Did you get back in it? Here. Retested the high. Late to do that, though. All right, I'll be back on in a second.